Did it work? No, I have to manually do it. Because why the hell would I be able to just once? Just once. I have to do it manually. Did it work? Yay! It worked! Woo! Christmas time! Mistletoe and... Wine. Oh, fucking hell. I immediately spill it on my white onesie! Why do these things happen? Why do these things happen? Ah, oh, that isn't fair. Um... Give me a second, I have to deal with this. <laughs> because I can't just leave a wine stain on my... Who buys a onesie that's white? I didn't buy it, my sister gave it to me. I'll be back in a second. One, one second. I didn't unmute myself, it doesn't matter. Um, I just bought the entire... I don't even know why I BRB'd it, so I literally just ran into the other room, grabbed a pack of the baby wipes, and... Well... <laughs> I'm gonna put this on, like, Christmas morning, and Mum's gonna be like, you just drank, you spilled wine on that, didn't you? And I'm like... No? No? <laughs> yeah. Idiota. Idiota. Anyway, we're playing Spencer's Rampage. Yay! Don't adjust things on my desk unnecessarily because I'm the only one who can see them. Solo. None. Oh, not speedrun. Fuck that. No cleanup. Time to merch up. Yep. Uh, game rules? What's a sniffer? You know what? It matters not. Let's just do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it now. There is no evidence anywhere to support that supposition. Indeed, there is not! Except for a mild pink discoloration. Which could be explained by anything. Wow, it's even got Christmas music. I am not reading this. Great, let's go! Okay, it's been several weeks. The last time I played this was the last time I streamed it, so... I have no idea what we're dealing with. Well, the last time I did have some modicum. This is really loud! That's less loud. I like it. I like the less loudness. Uh, music. Uh, hold on. There's buttons. I'm making weird noises. That's okay. No, that's still... Oh, wait, I can turn it down on my end. How is it on your end? I just muted it. That seems... In some ways, I'm tempted to just... I didn't put together much of a Christmas playlist. A bit loud, okay. Okay. Why must you be so tiresome? Not you, chat. Game. Game. Why must you be so tiresome? Is that better? I'm only just sort of pressing it on the audio. The jig on OBS. A bit loud. I may turn this off. How do I turn this off? Be gone. Be quiet. How dare. Better. Okay, so I'll just leave that down there. I haven't really... There's something about having when drunk. Of the sentence. That I don't really look up. I don't look around. I don't see what is here. Can I get through here? Okay, now I'm just making more mess. There are dead gnomes. Elves? I'm not up on my Christmas lore. It's been a while. I'm gonna readjust my chair a little bit. Okay, better. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Already, you can only start. OMG! A cat! What's crazy about that is it even looks like the cat that I used to have. That's... That's... That's crazy. That looks just like Misty. That's actually... go away. I don't like it. That makes me sad. How dare. That was dis disturbing how much it was like my cat. So there's a lot of dead things, a lot of presents. I'm not sure what they're expecting of me. 
That's just a hole in the wall. It's not even a doorway. Okay. Elf emergency. Yeah. So, where is... This is quite a big place. I'm not sure we'll... That wasn't me. I'm not sure we'll get this all done today. We might. I'm stuck on a wall. Okay. Oh, right. This is the incinerator, I presume? The fireplace is the incinerator. Hooray. How do I yeet stuff? Okay, so I can only yeet with a mop, apparently, which is... Hmm. Well, nobody's sitting in that. Can I burn myself? It's not something I... Can I even crouch? I am impervious to heat. Well... The sooner I know that, the better. So, it's bodies first, if I'm going by the rules I dictated to myself last time. Body parts first. That chair is taking a long time to burn. The bodies aren't taking as long. What does Santa do? Jeez. Yeah, I didn't really put together my own Christmas service that well today. Because I, I knew when I... I Shorty Tickler. This sounds like a serial killer name. Where does this go? It's got a bit like a panel on the wall or something like it was last time, but this isn't exactly your typical science fiction setting. Haven't been in here. Huh. Oosh! Oh, what happened there? Quite a lot to clean. Where does this go? Interesting. I'm curious, can I just shove it up against this and it'll just be like... Yeah, so that's just where it belongs. I'm guessing no. The amount of he drinks in one night... Must have um, had a killer hangover. Yeah, considering how much like eggnog is left around and such. And cookies. No wonder he's overweight. I mean, I'm not fat shaming Santa. That's not something I'm doing. No. How dare you even insinuate such a thing? You go here. Where do these things go in this map? Oh, I dropped it. Give me that. Give me shorty tickler. Give me shorty tickler on the list of words I never thought I'd say. Chair, be gone. Okay, so there's a lot of blood everywhere. There's a lot of rooms. I'm not sure how much we're going to get done tonight. I just spat on my own keyboard. Okay. The body parts first. That is the main thing. Stop patting the air and pick up the dead elf. Well, at least these bodies are smaller than the other ones. Oof. The perception is somewhat dull. Doesn't help that these chairs are all in the way. Okay, so this is bucket machine, okay, and this is box machine. Alright, let's get rid of this thing. Be gone. The physics will be as fabulous as this. Exactly my point. The physics will be as fabulous as they were last time I played.
Lots of flash drives that I don't know where they go. I don't even know how I figured out the first time I played this that they go in the wall panel. But there is no wall panel, but there is dynamite. Can I light this? What happens if I put this in here? Please explode. I will be extremely disappointed if you don't. Yeah! <laughs> I'd also put out the fire for a little laugh. But you know what? Totally worth it. That was amazing. Put some more in. This is indeed dynamite. You're not supposed to put dynamite in Christmas crackers. Although that would certainly spice things up if you did. Love it. Okay, so that actually has no material purpose. It's just for the lols. And I feel like that in of itself is a material purpose. Oh look, someone's head. Where did that box go? Here. Nothing. I found my shit goes. That's the thing I knocked over. There's a gun here. There is a gun here. Can I shoot it? Huh. What if I put this in the incinerator? Will all the bullets explode too? I'm gonna be disappointed this time. I just know it. I was indeed disappointed. Okay. Broken bottle of slack spaniels. Slack spaniels. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That is your name, yeah. I don't know. What. And you, slack spaniel, you may. That's really bad. I like it. You're a disappointment of a boombox. I don't know what to do with these, so I'm just gonna pile them in this corner and then mop them up later. Chuck hurling <laughs> Chuck hurling to them now. <laughs> okay. Okay. You can have that. Oh my gosh, a dead gnome on the counter. That's very unhygienic. OMG TNT. OMG TNT. I'm just smashing this gnome's body everywhere. Elf's body is an elf, it's an elf, it's an elf. I apologize. But first, no, fuck you, present, nobody wants you, everybody wants TNT. TNT. Go boom. Boom. Again, which is good. No, nope, wrong button. This one. Thank you. You. Okay, so notes. I need to drop one of those in the fire. <laughs> Stand further back. Holy crap. That was better than I could have dreamed. <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, what the fuck is this? Hello. And you, sir. Wrong button. You, sir. No? I say, sir, you aren't fighting fair. No? That was awesome. Okay. So... I do believe it's actually giving me more work this time. Or... Is this... No, it, this is just the aftermath of the explosion. A lot of dead things, and everything's just blown off the table and all that. I don't know why I'm talking about this. This, this just happens sometimes, I just take on an overly British accent. Not the hat. 
may have to burn the hat too, I'm not entirely certain. I did not read the opening thing, not once, but twice. But Figgy, what now? Figgy Fafla? You guys have amazing names. Wait, I didn't read that one either. I just chucked it. Sticky Honey Toes. Amazing. I was so close, I'm just gonna dump it straight in. Any other body parts? There's, yeah, that is indeed a foot. Might even be Santa's foot. Seems a bit large for an elf's. Lots of flash drives I don't know what to do with. I should find a repository from OMG more TNT. Hmm. Looks keep A. I can't pick that off the shelf. Oh my gosh, a cat! Another cat! Aww. I can't zoom in on it, but I can scroll. I, I don't care which has it. might actually help me. Turing events has unfolded at this workshop must in no way deter you from performing your duties in a manner befitting the company's reputation. The work here entails cleaning up the horrific aftermath of Mr. Claus's unfortunate breakdown. This is the obvious sorter and any broken items and so forth. Broken items, okay. Please conduct yourself appropriately as this assignment will focus on your permanent record. Fail to follow company guidelines and regulations and you may find yourself without a job. Once your assignment is complete, the corporation will take ownership of the workshop and any remaining items and employees. Very well. Let's go blow some more shit up. Interesting. Okay, let's put some shit up and hide in another room this time. So I'm gonna stick this in here and then run away. <laughs> Didn't die this time. Excellent. Oh, somebody's been hitting the slack spaniel's hard. I can't say that sentence. Slacks can't somebody's been hitting the slack spaniel's hard. There's just something very wrong about that statement. Oh my goodness, this man is full of gnomes. Nope! He is full of knives. I didn't say that incorrectly. Wait, how can I yeet this? I cannot. <laughs> That's a lot of knives. Come with me, sir. They're gone. And nobody will ever know. Okay, so I'm supposed to be getting rid of bodies first. I do have a plan. Somewhere in the back of my mind. And it's mostly to... You know, Mr. Claus does on his downtime ain't got nothing to do with me. As that document said, I merely clean up after Mr. Claus. I only know we're responsible for Mr. Claus. Nor anything he may get up to. Why is this thing hanging so below my sight? You know what? It can just live down there. It's fine. Be gone. I'm looking for large body parts. Not a sentence I ever thought I would say. Something I've noticed is that when I've been watching a particular TV show for too long, I end up talking like the characters in it. Which is why, when I started watching Only Fools and Horses, I started greeting people with Hello, insert name here, me old China. That's how that happened. And now I'm watching Poirot, I'm talking like Hastings. Eh. OMG, another gun. This one will be as unsatisfying as the last, I imagine. Gone with you. Lots of presents. Do I burn the presents? Do I burn the presents? I don't know, but there's a foot right there. That should probably go. I'm stuck. It's fine. Uh, that's better. Okay, so I gotta look everywhere. I'm gonna start from here. Do you mind in here? Just to make sure I haven't missed anything. Body parts. There's a hand. Upstairs. Quite quick. 
Oh yeah, there's all this stuff. I'm just gonna use a box for that. Okay. This man completely fell to pieces. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Fell to pieces. That's not that funny. Shut up. Okay, no, I can't open those. And you're stuck on a wall. That is quite. It's quite unfair. That is quite unfair. It's quite curious about something, isn't it? They all look the same! My goodness, they are clones. Clone gnomes. Whilst also being elves. Just to make. just to complicate matters. A bit too funny. A bit funny too though. Yeah, that was funny. It's extremely annoying. <laughs> Where did it go? Physics. There's apparently options you can change for the physics to make them quote unquote normal or otherwise. I actually didn't look at the other options and frankly normal is pushing it. I'm not sure this qualifies as normal. And whose green blood is this? Is the predator been here? The gnomes green, green bleed green. Possibly. Omg! Another gun. And another smash bottle of slacks back. I can't. I can say it, but I can't say it. It's just something wrong. Fuck off, Sam. <clears throat> you Christmas me. Come on. Even if he did make a mess. I haven't actually checked. I completely got sidetracked from looking around for bodies. Oh my goodness, look! Bodies! Come with me. You have an appointment with the fire. The fire rises. I may have watched The Dark Knight Rises last weekend. <laughs> I actually really enjoy that movie. Not good, but I enjoy it. <laughs> Keep an eye on the time. Winkle Snuffles? Be gone. Snuffles. These are some amazing names. I should really be congratulating them on their imagination. Imaginativeness? Imagination. Sure. But wait a minute. I have boxes for this kind of nonsense. Uh, to the, to the right. I'm gonna leave it there in the off chance I accidentally knock it over again. Someone was using a shotgun. But then we've already seen a couple of weapons as well, right now. I find it actually quite impressive that in the last map I did, aka the only map I've done so far on stream, is that there were plenty of spent shell casings, but no weapons. Santa's Rampage seems to have quite an armory otherwise. Interesting. It's a fuckload of flash drives. And a foot. Hand. It kind of looked like a flash drive from the distance. From the distance? Oh fucking hell, who needs words? That's the writer. Mm -hmm. Right, more bodies are around. I'm glad I didn't start me from scratch when I blew myself up. That would have just been rather irritating. I don't know what I'm 
to get to do the trash thing. This is a very blood soaked stairwell. Well, at least they're in rather large parts. That was very considerate of them to die in smaller parts, or rather larger parts, fewer parts. Is this a church or a stable? Why is there so much dynamite? I didn't realize that Santa used so much dynamite. What does he use dynamite for? I'm genuinely curious. Just yeeted that guy in the fireplace. What does he use that dynamite for? I gotta watch Hogfather again. It's a damn good Christmas thing. Although I don't recall Death or the Hogfather ever using dynamite. Don't ask. Mm, I feel like I already have several times. But I will heed your warning. But I'm still wondering. Can you tell me, sir? For what does the Santa use the dynamite? Will you tell me? You're avoiding my eyes, sir. 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 I don't think he's gonna tell me. Forget the fact that he doesn't have legs. You seem more talkative now. I feel like I'm going crazy. Just a little bit. Sir! Can you tell me? For what? It's the Santa Claus. <laughs> <laughs> I can't take that seriously. I can't do it. Okay, forget it. Probably for blowing holes in the walls of his own home. But I digress. Or do I? That doesn't seem like the right word in this context. He meant the reindeer as well. Truly. What the fuck? Santa's a terrorist, right? That was him too, I guess. Yeah, there's just a bucket full of gnomes. Just a bucket full of gnomes. How is Santa take it? You know what? I'm gonna take a whole bucket. Why the fuck take it piece by piece? Maybe that's why. You! This this. You! That didn't work. Forget it. <laughs> fuck me. So many flash drives around. <clears throat> there are so many flash drives around. Why do they hang so low? I feel like that's a double entendre. <clears throat> you, sir. <laughs> Love it when I get stuck on the scenery. There's a lot of gnome in here. In fact, there seem to be more limbs than can be ascribed to one single gnome. I feel like I put at least three legs in there. Will you stop? Freaking doing that! Forget it, I don't even care. They're all gonna fall out, I don't care. I'm gonna stuck on Fuck off. Well, that went about as well as expected. <laughs> I imagine before the end, I will figure out what to do with the flash drives. There are an awful lot of them. Playing I Spy, or Where's Wally with the dismembered limb? There is definitely another one. Oh my goodness, what are you doing up here? Why'd you have two heads? This is a question that I cannot answer. Two heads. Fuck me. What the 
fucking bullet into that table. I'm looking in with gym knots or something. Well, this... What'd you call it? Debris is rather hindering my progress. gone on that counter I didn't even know it before. Did the, did the gnomes who are elves, who I keep calling gnomes, also have weapons? Were they able to fight back? I believe so, although it wouldn't be quite so much carnage. So much stuff. There are so many weapons in Santa's shack, you wouldn't think they would be, but then who else would supply the charters with weapons? Hmm. Do I burn this thing? I don't like it. Go away. I, I don't like that. That's a really nice shotgun. That is a nice shotgun. I like the green and red paint job. Green and red! I actually did this last year. It's nice actually having nails for once. Say for once. Out of a year. Which is nice. I don't have good jumps. I really don't have good jumps. But there. Beat your rules. I say. Alright, use your brain, eh? I still don't really have a good lay of the land at this place. But this is a reason. Okay, so this is, I presume, Santa's office with, with the cat picture. It's actually several cat pictures. Oh my gosh, another one. Santa was a cat lover. OMG, another one! Great, that's three that I know of. Hmm. He ain't a true nerd until he's got posters on his ceilings because he's run out of wall space. For some reason I am being a detective, which uh, I'm usually just a cleaner. I have no other capacity in this one. And there are no other doorways up here. Although there is this dead gnome that I completely miss. He's nodding, he agrees. Good. Alright, where's the fire? It's right over there. I almost walked right past it. I'm stuck on a present. I am stuck on a present. Oh, I guess that counted. Where did this head go? Oh wait, that's his torso. Just, just disappear. It's, it's better this way. Right. I'm just gonna get these out of the way so I can actually walk around and not trip over everything. Stool! Who I will almost certainly knock over shortly. Am I standing on you? I am. Excellent. Good job. So it's still this. Yeah, I just realized this makes no difference how much fucking dynamite I'm gonna be sticking in that fireplace. We're gonna get blown off the table again, and let's face it, there is no way I'm not putting more dynamite in that fireplace. There is no way I am absolutely doing that. I'm tempted to put that stereo in the fireplace also. Watching me. Okay, take it these guys aren't trash, they are like meant to be figurines. Be gone. OMG. What? Oh, there you are. Oh, you metamorphosed. You're not very good at your job, are you? Chuck Hurley, such a bad name. Okay. So, all the presents on. I'm actually going to put the stools up there as well, so I don't trip over them all the darn time. Did I have to burn the present too? It took me working with myself to cure me of my nail biting. Ah, uh, yeah. It's almost as if you like... Words are coming. They're there. If your hands on all the time, then you're just less likely to bite because of all the things they've touched, that sort of thing. I used to bite my toenails. 
I'm not sure if I was actually going to share that, but it's out there now. This was uh, over 10 years ago, I'm happy to say. I was a teenager. Uh, okay. It's going to take some explaining, but probably not, but I'm going to do it anyway. Uh, I used to bite my nails and my toenails terribly. I don't even know why. Stress, I guess. Anxiety, all that jazz. And there is a point to this story, but I forget what it is. Fuck me and my ability to talk. I just caught up myself to a corner. I used to bite my toenails. It was super gross and completely unnecessary. And frankly, so was biting my actual like, fingernails. Like, why did I do it? Stress, I guess. Ugh. Gross. You're not the only one. I'm glad to hear that. <laughs> Oof. My dad was actually kind of horrified when I told him, I confessed him that I bit my toenails. And he was just like, no wonder you had like so many stomach upsets. And I'm just like, eh, <laughs> you're not wrong. But yeah. Stool! Be gone. If we could just get everything out from under my feet, including you, that would be good. And then I'll just sort everything out. Everything else out later. Like this. Another fine and dandy shotgun. She's going straight on the fire. Uh, let's. Do you ever just walk through a doorway but don't you just hit the door frame instead? Depth perception, or something along those lines. That's a lot of knives. I haven't even started mopping stuff up yet. It was my birthday Friday, Mommy got me only 23 presents on a soccer field cake. I hate her, I said you were better, I want 23 steak pies, 12 ice creams, 18 trays of reindeer chocolates, 3 big boxes of fudge, and a pair 5 computer, that'll be Apple. It's conscription 3, I don't know what that is. Brown Ops, Black Ops, conscription, oh it's Call of Duty. Brown hearts <laughs> and a nitrogeny go kart. CV chirps. Santa Claus. No wonder he snapped. Let's see what the other ones say. It's gonna be a hell of a. I want a new Playbox 180 and a new iPhone 732S and uh, the new Racer Man car driver game. I also want a new bike because the last one I got last year was dirty and I'm on a new Windbreaker Air Rifle too. I've been so good at one these days. Billy's spoiled. Ugh. Happy Christmas. This year I want the new Arachnid Boy comic, Spider-Man, a new motorbike, a new archery set, a new 58-inch television, a killer falcon like the one Uncle Gunther has, a new stereo to make the butler mad, and a big tin of chocolate caviars. How old are you? That's not saying much. I remember one time I was in... It would be about 20 years ago now. Probably a little bit more. A little bit less. Fuck me and my math skills. My parents got like wine bottle shaped liqueurs where you bit the top off and they'd be full of like alcohol based chocolates or something. I don't think they knew it was me that I bit the tops off of those and drank a lot of them. To be fair, there were only like eight of them. Although I was under ten at the time, so it's not great. But that's a memory that I have. Uh, the red one's not the shit purple one you gave me last year, blug. I have been very good and they kicked people at school this year and the butler and that man at the carnival. And that was the only one time except for the clan at my birthday. Fair Timothy, cruelly, cruelly. Um, people are dicks. I'm not surprised at all the snap Santa snapped. Smanted. Sapped. One of those. I'm, in re I'm reading all of these. Dear brother, I'm in jail again and need bail money. I was caught whipping children in the streets. It's this one town that always trouble. I know you told me not to go out at Christmas, but why must you have all the fun? I'm so bored. I hope you send an elf for the money soon. I do like elves. It's so fragile. That's kind of creepy. Remember you owe me one for that Russian mafia incident? Your brother. Krampus! You know, I don't actually know who Krampus is, but I keep hearing about him. And he is Santa's brother. So, yeah. I don't know what it means about the Russian Mafia. There's still four more of these, plus some dynamite. Mr. Claus, it is with great regret that I find myself forced to write this correspondence once more, as our investigation determined that atrocious, the atrocious conditions which you must, which you force upon our elven brethren must cease immediately. The low pay, the incredibly long work days, the lack of four days, it's inhuman. Forget that they're elves. If we at the Union do not see radical changes in the next three weeks, we'll be forced to pursue legal channels. And then, sir, you shall see that the full fury of the elves is not so small. Good day, tiny Littleton, Secretary General. I feel like I have more. 
more fights if they, if they if I hadn't said it like that. Urgent, says the knife, with its swipiness. You know the noise it makes. I'm losing it. Okay, Mr. Claus. It is with heavy heart and dwindling pocket that we regret to inform you that you are being sued in the amount of $250,000. It's really no surprise it's under a fucking meltdown. The claims are as follows. Destruction of property, damages, emotional suffering, public disturbance, and obscenity. Apparently your reindeer had defecated across a house or houses as they passed through the area. For full claims and details, please read thoroughly for pages 5 through 49. That's all there is. And we'll bin all of these at some point. So one more and the knife goes again. Dear Mr. Claus, I have in my possession video footage recorded in an infrared of you along with your gang entering one of my premises via the fireplace. The footage also showed littering and for you personally review removing my valuable property, milk, glass, and confectionery items. There goes that. You say it's milk. Let's face it. We all know it was eggnog. We all know it was eggnog. At present, I am preparing to forward this evidence to local authorities and as I receive compensation for your organization in the sum of no less than $100,000. I've generously decided to give you until Monday to complete this transaction or face the consequences of your transgression. Yours faithfully, Lord Deviant Sacred. Bloody hell. Wish all these guys didn't have James Bond villain names. There was another letter. Here it is. Your all tired greetings, Mr. Claus. I represent a select group of people with great gift giving ambitions. If these clause are looking for more people as it comes, please join the mission of great things. We do to great things. This is the living legend. There was a crumbling in the air, with snow and giving anointed spring and clean cake cake. Uh, Hi, Corey! Yikes! How's it going? We're reading really, really dubious material in Santa's workshop, which should not be given further attention. I'm gonna burn the shit out of that. How are you doing? Let's blow up some shit. That's just kind of the day it's turning out to be, and I'm gonna go hide in the other room! There he goes! Hello! Yeah, we're gonna burn all this shit. I'm using a lot of money for friends. And yep, everything fell off the table again, but that's okay. That is okay. There's another rifle. Hold on a second. What is. Oh no! That was my box full of dead things. It just spotted them all over the everywhere. That's not good. That's not good at all. It is fun. It's very bloody and, and slightly tipsy, I will confess. But how are you? How are you? And thank you for dropping by. It's nice to see you. It's put. It's stuck on the edge of my box. Get in the in the box. In the. This, I should have dumped this before blowing up the TNT. But you know what? Mistakes have been made. It's just how it happens sometimes. I don't know where that went, but that's fine. Okay, you, sir, need to go away. I am good. Oh, the horror lol, that was enough. Yeah, that was a lot of elves. Oh my gosh, look, another bit. Nope, that's a shotgun shell. We were just reading all about Santa's troubles. Apparently he's been, like, sued for a lot of money. And being accused of being a bad employer with the elves. And I feel like we already knew all that, but he didn't react very well, which is why they called me. Yeah, it's kind of bad. That's bad. It's freaking catastrophic. I think I've got most of the dead bodies, although I'm gonna by one click once over, which I didn't even say yet. I mean, I'm gonna have to look quite around, but they're still not really familiar with this place. I mean, I found a bucket of known parts in here. Oh, look, more TNT, but we'll save that for later. No, they even killed the reindeer. He even, he even killed the reindeer. But they had plenty of weaponry. I feel like the gnomes fought back. I mean, that's gotta count for something. Maybe. Yeah, it's been pretty bad. Good, there isn't an under the stairs. Okay, so this is Santa's office. I was already in here. He was hitting the drink pretty hard. That's not what I meant to do. The slack spaniels. I really don't like saying that. There's just something about saying the slack spaniels. Uh, that just does not sit right. And then upstairs, I believe I just jumped right off 
because me mastering a keyboard is definitely far beyond me. There's a lot of flash drives and I don't know where to put them, like in the irregular ones. There's like a crinkly coin purse. What is that? I don't need to know. Okay, we need to get everything off the floor. In fact, I may just burn all the presents. Sacrilege, I am aware. But, it's just gonna make my job a lot easier because cleaning all this stuff up is gonna knock everything all on the floor again. And, yeah. I'm just gonna toast. I'm pretty sure the guns are meant to be burned. Maybe. Nope. Up. Good. That'll do. Plenty of pictures of cats around here. Not sure what that says about most cat lovers. Considering. Pretty sure this is a Santa Claus and he has all the cats in here. He also has. What the fuck is that? I don't even know. But yeah, I gotta find a place to put all these flash sappy <laughs> I can't even read these names. Waxy pictures! <laughs> okay! <laughs> I need to find a special little bucket and put those in because they gotta go somewhere and I'm pretty sure it's not the incinerator as much as I wanna put them in there just to get them out of my way. Okay, so I'm gonna check something real quick. Yeah, uh, which isn't here. Maybe it's a. No, it's not the mop. It's not the hand. It's not that. Notes. I got no notes. It's great. Objectives. It's just, uh, no, give me that back. Thank you. No, not that. That. Get out of here. Yeah. Uh, please conduct myself appropriately. What does that actually mean? Those who follow company guidelines. I don't know what they are. Uh, may find myself fired. That's fine. Once you're shown the blah 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 blah. I'm tempted to just throw everything in the fire, especially the TNT. Can I fix this? Can I readjust this? I'm pretty sure it's not meant to be that way up. Crap, this is not look up yet. There's, there's blood on the ceiling, there's also blue on the ceiling. That's curious. And I'm gonna put everything back on the table again, you know, just for the next time that I. Set up some TNT in the fireplace. Ah, how often does that happen? More often than you think. Oh, I am really tempted to just burn everything. <laughs> everything. Except the figurines. Call me a nerd. This is that. Fancy. Bye. Yeah, okay. So body parts are all gone. I think next time it's just big things, isn't it? I don't know where the presents are supposed to go. So I'm probably going to get fired for this one. But I've also been drinking on the job, so... It doesn't really fit, does it? Okay. So the big ones, maybe not. Okay, but the small ones, they can absolutely go. Goodbye. And hopefully they won't wear the chemical compounds that would release bad gases into the oxygen matrix. That is just... Words mean something somewhere, I'm sure. Hmm. This is a big one. I don't know what to do with these things. These weird little... I don't like it. I don't like it. Well, unless it comes back to haunt me, I don't really care. Okay. Probably not going to burn all this. But I just want to get it out of my way. I've got shit to do. 
And if Santa didn't want me to steal it, then steal it, <laughs> burn it, then he should have thought about that before going on a titular rampage. How dare. Sick. No. Nope. I want to set up my tablet in the dog. It's the game. Come on. You're an embarrassment. Not just to me, but to... This is like setting up my frickin' Star Wars figurines! That'll do. Bloody hell. Alright, I'm just gonna put my... I'm gonna put my... Uh, I'm gonna put the flash drives somewhere. But I'll do that after I've gotten rid of the biggest ones. And the smallest ones, at least. Because I can't get rid of the biggest ones. Because they're too... Well, big. I shouldn't be burning these because I'm gonna get fired. But they're in my way. This actually does remind me of the day of the job. The day of the job. These weird little voodoo dolls to go. Voodoo dolls? Yeah. Sure. Figurine. That looks like a gravity hammer. It does look like a gravity hammer. That's cool. I should have got. I should have really thought out my Christmas playlist a bit more because this in-game one is already repeating itself, but then anyone that I would have made would have repeated itself too. Oh, he's kind of cute. Let's see if he's going to go as well as the other one. Yep. That'll do. Yeah. We get a tub with the smaller items. Everything else must go. Everything must go. So done from burning these Christmas presents. I feel like it's almost like sacrilege or heresy or something to be doing this at Christmas. I'm just burning all the presents. There was another gun. But Santa really needs to rethink his strategy. It's like weaponizing his workforce does not seem like a good plan. It just does not. This will almost certainly not go. It won't fit. This is such a mess, and most of it's just my footprints. Oh my gosh, they're everywhere! So many footprints. I'm gonna keep just tripping over everything. Like this rifle, for example. It looks like a shotgun. It may in fact be a shotgun. So many weapons! Nice. I'm sure I'm showing like even borderlands. Pleasant looking fellow. You can go up here with your friends. You actually stayed relatively standing. Go home, monsters friend. You're drunk. In fact, they all look kind of drunk. Oof. Ay, ay, ay. It's amazing how much you can get tripped up on in this game. I mean, actually, physically get tripped like, like that. I just. Fucking hell, it just launched me across the room. There are 
had so many presents in other rooms. So many. Is this a thing? Is that a thing? That is indeed a thing. Okay, so for now, we put these on the table just to get them out of my way. I'm gonna try to burn them in the process. Because I feel like no matter what's going on, you need stools. Stools are useful. Oops. Sorry. That's for my shit. That'll be useful eventually. Right. Just gonna get everything off the floor in here, and then I can sell in the other rooms. This is a bigger problem than I expected going into it. fun. Very nice. I'll just go straight in the fire and shit. <laughs> okay. Ah, shit. Okay, that, that wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Usually when I light it, it just throws everything everywhere. You are trying my patience. But I've got to watch Lion King again. Without a Lion King Okay. So I think we're mostly cleaned up in here? Mostly. I'm gonna find a place to put these bloody flashlights. Flashlights, you keep distracting me. Stokey Piddlefinger! That's, that's bad. Perkin. Snot sort? Oof. Nasty. Piggy fast one? I can't that one as well. Who came up with these names? It's quite ingenious. Is that the little thing? I'm gonna put them up here now. There is a place to put them, I just don't know what it looks like in this nasty big place. Nice to see you again. Uh huh. Happy stickles. There you go. Ha! 
can't crouch at this point. No. I believe there's anything under those tables. Not what I thought. Itchy Fritz puzzle. Naturally. Jig oinkle bell? I hope, I really hope these aren't like created through an algorithm. I really hope that somebody just went through and created relatively weirdly sounding festive things. Very disappointing. If they were created an like, by an algorithm. This room is almost done. I shouldn't really do it room by room. It's the easiest way. But no doubt there will be things that I miss. But that's just how it is all there. <laughs> Tanky two feet. Can't miss him. could have been used as an online generator, but hopefully someone actually thought of it this. Yeah, I'd like it. I don't, wouldn't mind so much if it was an online generator. Somebody, so long as somebody like thought of the individual words first and then just loaded them into like a, like a generator. That would be kind of cool. I mean, I get why algorithms are used as like a really handy way of just doing things really quickly and just like efficiently, but I also kind of hope that... Oh shit, shit, put that down! It'd be nice if they just did that. Use their imagination a bit. They're just creating something. Although, frankly, creating something that then searches out festive sounding words and then sticks them together to randomly generate a game. That is, in of itself, pretty freaking creative. Though I can't really fault them for that. But I think... That's it for this little room on this level. I'm gonna put this somewhere so it stops annoying me. Where? Probably... No, I'm just sitting here. OMG, a thing! I saw that. You can't hide it from me. Hi! Hi. Yay, I'm back! I'm doing cleaning. This is literally my day job. <laughs> I'm doing it in a video game. So, I was gonna... I had a plan. I had a good plan. I had a cunning plan. They do occasionally occur. And it was mostly involving of doing it systematically in an efficient and orderly manner. Look at Machete. I did the bodies first. Scratchy side fest. That is amusing. We'll eventually find out where these go. And I think I'm gonna do up here next. I get rid of all the small presents because apparently I hate Christmas. That's apparently a thing. Crinkly coin purse. I already read that one. <laughs> it's still kind of funny. Also doesn't sound like a name. It's not like a description of an item. There you go. This is a light I can put on. You can just live there. You are not offensive in any way, sir. This, however, is extremely suspicious and OMG... Santa is a friggin' serial killer, ladies and gentlemen. You saw it here first. What the f- Fuck it, I did not expect this! I did not expect this! <laughs> I did not expect this. He literally hides the bodies under the floor box. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, it does actually make sense. I'm about it. Time for some TNT. You know, after I've cleared out the big stuff. 
I'm like literally hiding out for the number of robots. He must be stopped! Not cleaned up after, and she says that she continues to clean up after him. It's my job. I am literally just crime scene cleanup crew. I, I don't decide what happens to the people who create the crime scenes. I just go ahead with my pizza with go. Excellent sort of I just clean up after him. Have you ever seen Sunshine Cleaning? That's a damn good movie. Fucking sad though. But damn good. It's basically about what I do for a living. Except sadder, because I'm literally cleaning up the Santa and it's kind of goofy, I guess. I'm gonna pick you up like this and then lodge you like the back. Like that, like that. Yeah. That's Santa is a dirty, dirty murderer. Now I gotta be more observant because those globals are clearly something I click on, which means there's probably. Also, did I miss this body before or did it just fly out of globals when I was ripping them up? I just wonder what like, note you ever got like, post game if you'd missed that. Like, a news flash, like. Santa trips up on the corpses he left under the floorboards. Well, that's not my fault, that's his fault. I can't be held accountable for the bodies he purposefully hid under his own floorboards. I didn't know to rip him up. I mean, I could have just for the fun of it, but it's not like a priority for me to rip up my client's floorboards. But I could. It's absolutely something I could do. Anyway. Okay, get out of here. Who are you? You are Tall Longfinger. I dislike that name. Little Tingles. I also dislike that name. There's just something very uncomfortable about both those names. Tall Longfinger. I don't like it. I do not like it. I do not. Well, hi, Mark. Eventually, I will start mopping. You know, mostly my bloody footprints. They're everywhere. Everywhere. Also, this automatic machinery. Machinery? Weaponry. I'm going to have to that would, you know. I'm going to be really curious about all floorboards from now on. In game, that is. Although now I'm probably going to be curious about my parents' floorboards. Hmm. Don't stand up, good. I really hope there isn't just a time where I'm just hanging out in the kitchen and I just suddenly get really suspicious of the floorboards in there. Just like, my parents hiding something? How dare you hide this arm from me? Who did it again, gosh darn it? Excellent arm hiders. Patch, but okay, I gotta take these downstairs. Stick them on the table with all the others. And eventually, I gotta mop the table. Who mops the table? Honestly. Who wipes the table? I don't think I've ever mopped the table. Except in like, the last resort. I'm stuck on. something. No. We be stuck, but. <laughs> That's really bad. There's a shotgun shell there that I must take note of. Or do I? I don't have any other shotgun shells that are up here. I've already lost it. Okay. Put me with the other shotgun shells. There's a few. Oh, and goodness. Okay, so, Santa, my parents say I was good so I could write you and ask stuff. So I want the new Super Turbo Jet with the car with all the extras, and also I want also chocolate and the Wipad 8 Dewey Water Pad. That is a terrible name! Hello, Mr. Santa. I don't want any more stupid books again. You must give me the new Ultra Mega Water Blaster Assault Cannon, and I want the big XX5 one so it will be bigger than Kenny's one. 
I'm gonna fill it with acid from my daddy's shop and spray down old Mrs. Crouch's car. Then teach her for calling the cops again and hurry up Stephen Creeley. What the fuck is wrong with these people? Screw you, Stephen Creeley. I had a pile. Okay, old children. Mr. Santa, I was good this year, so I want a pony and a bike and a new clarinet too. Timmy Sleeve Bottom. You know what? That's the nicest letter I've seen in this entire game so far. So you know what? I hope Tommy Sleeve Bottom. Sleeve Bottom. Gets what he wants. And he wants a clarinet. Who plays the clarinet anymore? My sister used to play the clarinet. But that was 20 odd years ago. I don't play it anymore. That's because she has babies now. Babies play them all the time. But my, my sister's babies are lovely. By babies, I mean one baby. She's technically pregnant with a second, but I don't know what that baby's like yet. But the first one is wonderful. She's so cute and just so really nice. Didn't expect it. But then I never really acknowledged the fact that any of us, me and my three siblings, could even have children, which is weird. But they are really nice. They. My niece, Melody, is really, really lovely. She's really cute. And this will not be her first Christmas, but the first Christmas she's aware that it's Christmas, so that would be cool. You strange puppet creature, you will also go in the fire. I keep wanting to quote Bane, but I'm going to try not to. Because I, I literally only remember one quote relating to fire. Uh, chair. Depart from these lands. Indeed. I keep losing things. I keep losing. Where did that go? Where did that. Where did that candy cane go? Candy cane, man. Go for you, Blink Coco. Where did it go? You know what? Doesn't matter. It's like when you drop something small and it just disappears forever. It's gone. Get rid of this though. I like guns that have knives on them, it's just like extra insult to the people that they kill them. That was a weird statement. Okay, so I'm only destroying the small presents because I can. You're not small. Hello? Okay. Small presents. Another shotgun. Well, I'm kind of glad the elves at least armed themselves. So they can fight back even if it was ultimately pointless. And they all got slaughtered anyway. You count as big, you can stay. Having it this suspicious, are you? You're very shiny. Interesting. Oh, you. You need to go somewhere. Hey, he's actually standing up. Amazing. Oh! I'm standing on the thing. Okay, that was impressive. I gotta sneak around for suspicious floorboards. Although I probably won't see any until I've mopped up during my footsteps. Footprints, footprints! Or someone. But I need. Yeah. Thank you.
Oh my goodness. <laughs> For fuck's sake, auto mod. Allow. Midget is allowed. They were like. They would be just like a midget purpose in the world instead. That's probably true. But yeah. I gotta actually look at my auto mods on. I believe it's stream elements because it, it's like every not every stream but every other stream I have to do, have to like allow a comment or other that's perfectly innocent and it's just like this is a bad word. Yes, I was doing something. I was doing something before that happened. So yeah, I can imagine the gnomes would be quite difficult. Especially when armed. Shotguns and such. I feel like there was more. Oh look, more. Can I read this one? Yeah, that was the good boy. Or it's close to the good boys you can get. How dare. Get in there. How dare. <laughs> Mm -hmm. It's like it doesn't want me to throw it away. Well, tough tip. It's not just targeted me there. No, it's happened to several people. I mean, you remember, I think it was last stream, when in Curtis, they'll do brothers got blocked for this saying hello. Granted, it was the same hello I gave to him, which is, hello, Curtis, me old China. And he said it to me, except the planting Curtis, that's my name. And he got timed out. And I'm just like, why? Why did that happen? Although I don't know if that was the same thing. Oh look, the shotgun. I tossed that down here. Of course I didn't, I knew that. Of course I knew that. Right, so, next room. Which I guess this counts as... Oh look! Winkle Snuffles. I'm going to read every single one of these out. Oh, M. Goodness. That's where they go! We found it! The Punchmatic! We found it! Woo! Okay, great. So I know that now. So, uh, Stinky Smiddlefeet. These do sound like Hobbit names. A little bit. A little bit. Trixie Pine Hat. I do like the name Trixie. OMG, a mop. I'll take that. I'll also just switch back to me handos. Okay, there's two. Not that it matters, I can just do them one by one. So I bring a box and tie it into one hallway for two shotgun shells. Come on, me. Hype! Hype for the punch matic that's, that's what it's called. I knew that. <laughs> okay, I gotta try not to walk into anything. Because anything can knock anything out of my hand. So is this a thing I can do anything with? I'm guessing by my grabby hands, the answer is new. Okay, so I know where all they go now. That's a lot of them, so I'm just gonna do them right now. Jig Dinkle Bell. I don't think I read that one before. Yep, definitely read that one. Goodbye, Weepy Sockfoot. This entire stream is just gonna be me reading out these names. Happy Stickles! Stumpy Patchfoot. To read them out like they're going for the sorting hat of Hogwarts. So it would be Long Finger Tall. I really hate that name. <laughs> I really don't like that name. Itchy Fritz, but well, have all, have all. I don't know. There's a lot of things to get on it, dude. Yep, read that one too. I read all of them. I don't know why. Though. But also really, really funny. Like Stokey Piddlefinger. The word piddle is just not great. That's a stool. That's not what I meant. Take it back. There's a shotgun shell at my feet. It was blending in with the blood. Come with me. You do not belong.
This whole thing goes. That doesn't even sound like a name. And I dropped that one. Away with you. Alright, is there anything else in here? There's the Misty Cat. It really does look like my cat. It really, really does. It's uncanny, actually, the similarity. The resemblance. That's nuts. Hold on a second. I gotta just do something real quick. Uh, did it work? Good. That was my cat. Oh, it's defaulted for some reason? Do you mind not doing that? But yeah, that's my cat. And I guess you'll clean up. That's our cat. The similarities are odd. Strangely very specific. Don't you look so beautiful? <laughs> okay, I'm making myself bad now. Uh, buttons? Okay. That'd be a sneaky. She looks so beautiful. Okay, that's the game. But yeah, very similar. It's quite scary how similar. We need you, poopy. Oh. She was so annoying. <laughs> she was so annoying. She was lovely. I used to wake up with her sleeping on my back. Like, square on my back. She would just be sleeping and purring in my ear. And just wonderful. Ah, oh, there's a lot of shit in here. Okay. Fuck off. Fuck off. So I'll be burning most of these presents and I'll probably get shit for it, but I just want them out of my way. Oh, this is easier. There'll be footprints on the desk instead. No, not that one. The small one. Everything on the floor. Everything on the floor. And tiny stockings! That's also not a name. But who am I to judge, really? You, sir! You belong on a shelf. Somewhere. Stuck? I'm stuck. What the heck? What the? Okay, I am through. It's pretty crowded, but I'm sure you'll fit in. Yeah, old friends here. I don't know what the hell they're doing. Everything that doesn't need to be on the floor, off the floor. Which is mostly the stools. Super focused on just throwing presents on the floor right now. I'm gonna try not to throw too many of the, the larger ones. Wow, well, it really doesn't want me to pick this thing up because I think it thought I was standing on it. Which is possible, it's possible I was.
don't think I'm gonna finish this all tonight. That's okay. That means I can do it next Christmas. <laughs> it's entirely possible that I'll finish this next Christmas. OMG! Another present! You thought you could escape me. Wait, you probably can escape me, actually. How do I get you out of there? Uh -huh. No, you can stay. You are a worthy adversary. Okay. Catchy little arm. I feel like catchy is literally no value in festive slash yuletide whatever magics. Nope. Silky Jingles! That sounds like a Christmas themed stripper name. Silky Jingles. Sounds a little good. Nappy Fun Pants! Na <laughs> I've about had it up to here with your nonsensical gibberish. Nappy Fun Pants! <laughs> Nappy Fun Oh my gosh, another mop. I'll take that. Although I already have one, so this one is actually for the fire. Hey! Let's go find some more dynamite. Dynamite. OMG, dynamite. Dynamite. Yay! All the dynamite. What are you doing down here, you heathen? Oh there. OMG, there's another shelf I can put all the figurines on. That's awesome. This is a very full room. Burn all the presents. Burn the presents. This is sacrilege of some variety, I'm sure. Look. I'm really good at getting stuck on just terrain. In case in point. I really, really, I feel just really bad about burning all these presents. I know I shouldn't be doing it, but they're just in my way. Speaking of, where did that one go? There you are. There's just so much I need to do, otherwise I'm going to get shit for this. I know it. At the end of the day. Which may in fact be next Christmas, because I don't think I can finish this tonight. There's a lot to do. Oh, wait, this is a big one. Big ones stay. You, sir, can stay. Well done. You're big enough. <laughs> big enough. <laughs> Terrible song, but I feel like showcasing that I'll probably get muted for, but I also get launched across the room. But I also don't care. I feel like just throwing... <laughs> throwing something goofy. <laughs> of course, there is actually no yeet. Except... <clears throat> How the fuck does that work? I throw it at myself? What the hell? I just yeeted it. I didn't even yeet it. I just batted it in verse. You are big. You can also stay. You are big. You can also stay. But not there. Ah, <laughs> The physics stopped making sense in this game after a while. You're not technically allowed to walk over debris, so it just launches you into space instead. Or as near to space as you can get at Santa's Grotto. I feel like... I don't know about you, but Grotto never seemed like a very, partic very particularly pleasant word or pleasant sounding place. Grotto to me strikes the word grotty, which is not a good word. It's not a pleasant word. It doesn't describe anything nice. It's stuck. Oh look! You can go on the shelf that I... If I can navigate through the doorway backwards. You. Hey, the candles there. Can I light those? Can I light them with dynamite? I think that's the main question. You can say you're big. So that I'm 
prejudiced against small things, which is ironic. off. Okay, let's see. Yeah, still just getting rid of presents. I'll probably clean up that room and then drop the call it. I really wish there was another way into that room that wasn't a hole in the wall. But it does seem like it's accessed from a different place. Yeah. Oh, indeed. A clue. Not you. Whiny whimper. Oh, you were just having me on at this point, man. Oh my gosh, the physics. The physics. The physics. Where did it go? Sure. Sure, it could end up there. There's so many presents in this room, I don't think I'm gonna get everything I need. I need everything done by nine. Which is what I'm aiming for. It's roughly 20 minutes right now. Just hope that my mastery over the keyboard is not on top form tonight. It's good sidestepping into furniture and doorways and such. Looking at that emote in chat, just the eyebrows. It's incredible. Can I just turn around? No, I just forgot where I was. Genius. Like how most of this is just me pacing back and forth, throwing presents into the fire. This feels, this honestly feels like a lot of sacrilege at this time of year. So many Christmas decorations, so many presents, and I literally just tuck, tuck, chucking them in the furnace. And walking into table corners as I go. I actually do that in real life. It's kind of embarrassing and kind of painful. How dare you? How, how, how dare you? Fuck, I don't know what happened there. Ah! Physics in this game! They are trying to kill me! Does a job then. Absolutely does a job. That is a killer emote. That is a killer emote. Wish I could read my arrows like that. Let's see. No, it just doesn't look right. I can't do the. 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 the whatever fake that is. Cannot do it. At least not without immediately laughing in my own face. Which is an impressive physical feat when you think about it. You can stay too. You are quite large. All the small things must go. And that apparently includes myself, because I am quite small. I like I should have been doing this with the boxes and just Instead of just pacing back and forth, I should have been doing it with a box, but I'm just kidding. A couple more things, and then I'll get a box. And then I'll probably finish this next Christmas! Hey! The other thing was the gun! And then I noticed the figurine on the floor, so I'll stick that on the shelf. Yeah, how dare you! Burn! There's some more guns, but they're quite small, and you, sir, it's got a lot of these figures. You can go up here. Hold on. Yay, are these candles meant to go? No, you can, you can stay. Okay, you can go. You can go, because I hate you. Goodbye. Seems legit. Bye. 
nice. That's how you keep falling down. Makes sense now. Have you always been up there? Depart from this plane. Box. Please don't give me bit. Please don't give me bit. OMG, a flash drive. Dimpy tiny toes. Wouldn't have got you if not for those bits. That's a wall. Genius. It's also a door. Not so genius. Oh, right, it comes up with order. the size you order it from. There. Wish it wouldn't deliver me bits. I know it's my robot masters, but even so, I am helping them dispose of everything. Wish they just wouldn't give me more work to do. Well, that is kind of the work. Nope. Hmm. Better. Nice. Now that's what I call results. gone with you. Nope, be gone. I didn't actually let go. Slight. Slight flaw. I will pick that, thank you. I feel like some of these bits are a bit too big, considering they are walls. Way too good at walking into walls in this game and just other stationary objects. Stationary, immovable objects, no less. Oh, fuck you. Ah, uh, yes. Is that it? Oh no, that was... I was gonna say that couldn't be it. I will say that with Gnome Spoiled, it's dramatically shocked... Dramatically shocking off the gut. I guess that makes sense. That's a sentence that works in this context, I suppose. Works about as, <laughs> as well as any other. Go in there. There, like that. Nice. You're an embarrassment to your species of candy canes. Candy canes. <sighs> gotta watch Mean Girls again. Definitely not a Christmas movie, but you got a Christmas moment in that movie. How much did I drop? A fair bit. Okay, good. Thank you. Oh 
my gosh, it's actually ridiculous how difficult I find it to go through that doorway. Because it isn't a doorway, it's literally a hole in the wall. Come on, Santa. Small things, small things. Like guns, and small firearms. Empty alcohol bottles. Tiny presents. How did I reach that one? Well, it knocked the other one in, so I guess that counts. Nope. OMG, a leg. I missed that. I'm gonna say, I do actually quite admire the physics in this game. Like, as it goes, it's not terrifically accurate, but it's not terrifically inaccurate either. Like, things fit, things slot in. Like, everything has its own physical presence, as it were. Nah, I can certainly appreciate. And when I'm done treading the pathways of blood and black. Night. I will mop. But first, I gotta get rid of all this shit. And I gotta look for other floorboards that Santa might be keeping dead elves under. Cause that's not fucked up. So a lot of that I'll probably be doing next year. I keep thinking this one splash of predator blood is a flash drive. And I'm not sure how because it's a pretty big splash of blood. Turn around. getting that bit of stone but it's not a door I keep wanting to call it a door but it is not a door it is not by any definition a door I don't even know how I can incinerate stone I guess that's a thing I never really thought about it Okay, so, now that we're done burning small presents, because, you know, it's a nice way of doing it, and we'll save this game. New save game. Great.